Welcome. Today, we're going to make sense of the distance formula. So let's just choose two random points in the coordinate plane. Let me choose it right here, and let me choose it right here. Now let's call this value x1, comma, y1, and let's call this value x2, comma, y2. To find the distance of these two points, that's to say, to find the length of this straight line that connects these two points. How can we find this length? Well, the first thing to notice is that notice that this is a diagonal distance. So instead of looking at it as a diagonal distance, let's break this down into its horizontal and vertical distance. So if I want to go from this point to this point, one way that I can go about it is move certain units to the right and then move certain units up. Now that blue line that we have in there, that's what we can refer to it as the horizontal distance. And that red line that we see in there, that's what we refer to it as a vertical distance. Now, what's the length of each of this distance? To find the length of the horizontal distance, I can find the difference between the x values. So we can write that down as x2 minus x1. To find the length of this vertical distance, well, that's the same as the difference of the y values which is y2 minus y1. Now notice that if we connect all those three distances, the green, the blue, and the red, we actually form a right triangle. And if this is a right triangle, then we can use the Pythagorean theorem. The Pythagorean theorem is a squared plus b squared equals c squared. And remember that A and B are the legs of this right triangle. Now we can let A be the horizontal distance. But notice that we know an expression for that. That's x2 minus x1. And now B is the value of the second leg, which is the vertical distance. We have an expression for that, y2 minus y1. And that is equal to the hypotenuse square. But notice that the hypotenuse is the actual distance of those points. So I'm going to call that d square. And if that's the case, then notice that now we can solve for d. We can take the square root on the right, and we can take the square root on the left. That way the squares are going to cancel out. And notice that now we have an equation for the distance. The distance among two points, which is just the hypotenuse of the right triangle, it is equal to the square root of the difference of x's square plus the difference of y's squares. And this is exactly how we can define the distance formula. Hello, if you would like to continue to learn about mathematics, you can check out the videos on the left.